okay? Yeah. All right, so again, I started at the collar line and I'm going to go through as much of the hair as I can that the clippers will go through because if it's matted, it won't go through. Also, if it's matted, the hair you cut there is gonna be shorter than the hair that you cut that wasn't matted. So you've got to um, figure that all out after he's bathed and blown out and everything, then you have to scissor him. This is for a show trim. This is for a, a, a good trim, an ideal trim, okay? Um, with, if it's a pet trim and you're gonna just trim him every few weeks and brush him and he's not showing or anything special, then, um, then you don't have to be so fussy, but unfortunately for me, I'm really fussy. So I'm gonna go ahead and try and get as much of this jacket off as long as I can right now, okay? Still trying to get this jacket off. For those of you who wonder why you have to pay your groomer so much, when all they have to do is just zip that jacket off with the clippers, it's hard work to get through these mats. See that? I, I have to push it, I have to pull out a little bit of hair. I can only do an inch or so at a time. On top of that, it hurts the puppy, right? They're not happy about it, right buddy? So, brush your dogs, brush your dogs. If you can't manage the hair, then, like if you brush them every day for five minutes, it certainly helps than leaving them for a long time and then asking your groomer to go through it. Okay, I'll keep at it. So I've gone as far as I can go with the clippers now. This is quite matted here and I can't get the clippers through that and I don't want to make it really, really short. So I'm going to have to brush this now and try and get some of that matting out at the root. And like normally again for a pet coat that you, you know, not too fussy about, I could just use a seven or a 10 blade there and it would come right off. But uh, I wanna leave some coat on, so I'm spending more time. So when your breeder or your groomer says, you need to brush these guys, no matter how long the coat is, or they'll get matted to the skin. This is what we're talking about. You can't see any skin there, and it's matted right to the skin. I'll show you the difference when he's clean. Also, the dirt collects in there. And when you wash it, it's hard to get that dirt out because it's tangled up in all those little spider webby hairs. And it's hard to get in those mats when you're washing. So a little bit of brushing really goes a long way in saving your poor puppy from having to go through this.